Here we go again. From the land of the retarded. I bring to you. Stephen Jackson. Once again. Once again. Feeling himself. He back home in Texas. Back around his family. So when guys do that, they normally feel strong. So before we get into this, <laughs> I just wanted to let everybody know I'm not a Steven Jackson hater. And we ain't just riding a wave. If you cannot see what's happening here, then hey, you know what? Enough of me talking. I'm going to let Steven Jackson talk and then see if you could translate what this really what's really being said here we're gonna see how smart people are go ahead captain jack most successful as that person so realize what it does for you bro it does nothing it just makes you it makes people understand that you're living in misery don't be that person that's behind the side bro follow people that you're a fan of because the, the hate and the comments don't work Y'all hated on my page all week. And what happened the next week? I got nominated for podcaster, the best podcaster in the country. Y'all playing y'all self, bro. Y'all playing y'all self. Y'all don't even know the y'all don't even know all the other stuff, phone calls I've been getting. My first movie this year. So what I'm trying to tell y'all is when you be positive and you spread vibes, good things gonna start happening to you. But when you be negative, you're gonna stay in that spot with the negative people who who's sitting at home doing nothing, ranting. We not doing that. We're not doing that, right? We winning in real time. In real time. I'm not, I don't hate on nobody. I show love to everybody and I'm winning in real time. Check the stats. This is not lies. This is not no opinion. We winning in real life. While y'all breathing, I'm winning. While y'all hating, I'm winning. So if, if you want to be on the winning side, if you want to be on the winning side, then spread vibes. Spread good vibes. Yes. Hey, hating is a mis hating is a miserable, miserable place to be in, and y'all can say what y'all want, but y'all opinions are not strong enough to change anything that's going on. And I can't but think that y'all that y'all think y'all a thousand opinions is gonna do something to Showtime. Are you kidding me? Listen, man, I love all y'all, but it don't work here. It never worked on real ones. I'm really from the mud. I'm really from the dirt. Ain't no mystery in my history. You can Google me. And I'm glad I've grown. But my growth ain't for you. These these checks I'm getting to, they ain't for you. You're not winning for a reason. Because you sit at home and hate that on people all day. Don't be that person, bro. Don't be that person. That's that's a miserable life to live. You're really dying inside. And, and half of y'all are fake pages. Would you tell me in the car? Tell me I if you wish them. Be proud of that, baby. Be proud to be Muslim. Every stick, proud of your dirty, proud of your D, man. Say, oh, and check this out. Don't don't be that person that has a fake page and go on everybody else's page and make comments from a fake page because they don't love themselves. Love yourself. Put your face on that page. Don't don't love yourself. I mean, you, put my face on it. You you be you. Don't hide if, if you know. Don't be. Don't hide from your comments. Stand behind your comments like we do. That's not real. But at the same time, a fake page only says two things. You don't. You don't love. You don't love who you are. You can't look yourself in the mirror. And it's, it's no need for me to kick you because you can't. You feel like that. I'm gonna pray for you. I'm gonna ask Allah to give you the strength to love yourself. I'm gonna ask Allah to give you the strength to stop worrying about what other people are saying. And try to benefit your life because one thing about it, Kwame Brown, Kwame Brown, rich, he good. Stephen Jackson, super rich, he good. Y'all comment on both our pages. Think about that. Y'all, y'all comment on, on Kwame Payne's, Kwame rich. Y'all comment on my page, I'm rich. Can't say the same about everybody that's with the fake pages. So look, bro, worry about what you control. Don't worry about Kwame. Don't worry about me because y'all not stopping nothing. Neither one of us got going on. All right, that that man, I, I'm not telling my ox and my fans from the ghetto to go on his page and say all this. I'm not doing that because we don't move like that. We don't move like that. We're in a different space, right? 
So just, I'm just trying to help y'all out, man, so y'all so days can be better, because y'all stress, y'all stressing and struggling for nothing. It ain't got to be like that, bro. It ain't got to be like that. Y'all call it what y'all want. The mystery, ain't no mystery in my history. I've been through real street stuff, and I ain't going back. And anybody really from the bottom that made it out ain't trying to go back. So y'all can have that. And one thing I won't do is play myself off the streets for a whole bunch of people that I don't know, that I'll never see, and that ain't, that ain't support me in no type of way. All right? So I'm trying to help y'all, man. I'm trying to help y'all. I'm praying for y'all. Y'all need the love. Y'all need to, to love y'allself first. And you wonder why you're in the position you're in because you stand behind. You go on people's favor. The quickest way to stay unsuccessful. That's the quickest way to not have God's favor. Right? Man, I can't believe y'all thought y'all was going to stop something. Y'all wrong for that, man. I can't believe y'all even thought that. More awards coming. More money coming. More sponsors coming. They call them by the day. Thank y'all. Thank y'all so much. Because, hey, hey, salt ain't nothing but season. Y'all didn't know that? Salt ain't nothing but season. But look, I'd rather them talk about it some type of way than not talk about it at all. You did. Much love to y'all. Organics, man. What's up, boy? I love y'all. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Much love to y'all, man. I don't want no problems, you know the youngsters, man. They turned up, they just got love for the OG, but I ain't letting them get no drama. We breaking bread, we just left Jumar. All these youngsters going in the right direction. My other youngsters on the right side of me just got out. You know what I mean? So, it's all love. I'm leading in the right direction, I'm going in the right direction. All right, facts over opinions, man. Check the scoreboard. I love all y'all, all my lawyer supporters. I love y'all, man. Stay tuned. We got a lot of good stuff coming for y'all. Movies, all kinds of stuff. We got our men, Matt, got our cartoon coming. So, man, we appreciate all the support, man. Everybody that's living in negativity and want to follow people that they don't love, I'm going to continue to pray for y'all. Because y'all got great to see y'all. Y'all just don't know how to get it out y'all yet. It's good when you go home for the holidays, you see your family, and you feel really, you know, confident. You know, you feel real confident, and you should be. You feel, but you, you, you know, you saying a lot of words um, that's pretty strong. And my thing is, why you got all this energy? For those people who you claim they have no power, they can't stop nothing. So if the people can't stop anything, so what you're saying is that they can't change. There's no way a change could ever ha happen then. Then why are you doing two, three, four lives talking about it? You see, that's this is the thing that blows my mind. It's like, why would you keep giving it attention? Why do you feel the need to keep letting and informing them, the people to know what's going on? You know, I know I'm just saying why to him is why I know why he's doing it. See what he's doing. For those of you who might not be able to catch up, you guys might say, man, all he's doing, man, is because I, I heard that in the last comments. Like, man, you took that all wrong, man. What he's trying to do is say we need to be positive, man. And not focus on the negative all the time. Ain't that what they do on their show? All the smoke? Smoke has never been about anything good. With well, somebody claiming they bringing all the smoke. Don't be, that person. don't be that person. Exactly what you just said, Jack. Don't be that person. Don't be that person, Jack. Don't be that person. Listen. I'm going to say it just like this. <clears throat> Jack has an issue. And the issue is his ego. He loves to have that ego stroke. Now notice. He set this up to make it appear, to make it appear as if he was the man. That's what he wanted y'all to think. 
This is Steven Jackson, the man. He made it look like I'm here to be, speak positivity. No, he's there to boast. The whole video was about him boasting. That was his about. I wasn't about no, I want y'all to be positive. He just out here trying to boast. That's all. He's still trying to show people he fly and he rich. That's all he wanted to do. Kwame Brown, he rich. Steven Jackson, I'm super rich. Come on, man. We can read between your lines. Dog, you, you so vain. You so vain, you don't even see it. You got your nephew in there talking about every clip, hold a third or better. You got him all in the background talking about clips and what they hold, arguing at people that got blocked. So they obviously didn't hit a nerve. But why you ain't trying to connect with him? Where's your apology at, brother? Why don't you reach to Kwame and say, man, I'm sorry. Why you on this live? You could have apologized to him on that live and said, brother, I'm sorry, man. You know, I, you know what? This thing got out of control, you know, and I'm sorry for all, any participation I did, every word I said. It's over, man. Let's just squash this and move forward, man, being positive. But you, your ego, man, you got a real ego problem. Yeah, and I see you trying, you are, you are work in progress. You trying to, you know, go the Muslim way and, you know, next thing you know, I don't know what's going on. You, you machine gun, <laughs> machine gun Muslim over here. To be Muslim is to be humble. You should know that. Every time you speak, you violate your haram. You don't even know it. That's a shame. It's a shame. A vain Muslim? That doesn't even make sense. But you have them. Some people become so full of themselves that they, they think that they are above people based on what they have. You could have so many millions of dollars. That doesn't mean anything, bruh. Because the people you yelling at, they put you in position to get that money. So why are you sitting there on the screen talking big, you ain't stopping nothing and this and that. Do you think you one, you're not super rich. So you might as well cut that. You're not super rich. Stop the cap. You're not. If you were super rich, you wouldn't even have made that IG live. <laughs> See, rich is when you no longer have to work for what you have. You got to work, Steve. You got to work. That ain't rich, bro. That ain't rich. You got to go up there at a certain time, clock in and go to work to get your money. You're paid well for it, but you got to work. So you're not rich. You just got some money. You got a lot of money, but you're not rich. Can you stop right now what you're doing and live out the rest of your life? No. Now, people like Jay-Z, they can say they're super rich. Nas can say he's super rich. You cannot. Now, congratulations. You want us to know that you got a movie coming. You want us to know that you got a cartoon coming. You want us to know that you 
finna get another award for podcast. That's what you want us to know. That's what you wanted us to know. I get it. I get it. But stop with the fake. All right, man, we got to be positive, man. Think positive. Then you can change your play. Then you don't got to. You just trying to boast and brag as if that's going to do anything to them. They still not going to like you. They still going to ride with Kwame. You mad Kwame got this wave. And he didn't have to go the route y'all went. And he already bigger than y'all right now. He ain't got to fly on a plane and go to ESPN Studios. He ain't got to go to Fox Studios. He ain't got to go to all these locations. And start putting on fronts. He don't have to go to a studio. His studio is right there from his phone or his PC. And you hate that. You hate that. <laughs> like, how did he get up here so fast? Now, you talk about positivity, but it's really out of hate. You jealous. I can tell a jealous person. I've seen this behavior. That ego, vanity, vain. That's why you won't apologize. Your ego, brother. Go out and tell the world right now. Apologize. Then I will take you seriously. Until then, I can't. I can't honor you, bro. Can't honor that. That's not how real men move. That's not how Muslims move. First thing you got to do when you become a Muslim is what? Drop your ego at the door. Right? That ego got to go. That vanity got to go. It's about a law. To be a good Muslim is to be humble, is to be a good citizen, is to be, and that is on the course of righteousness, right? Am I wrong here? Are there any Muslims there? Any Muslims out there that's in the chat, please let me know. Am I wrong? Am I getting some of this wrong? I don't, don't want to be wrong. I want to be right as rain. Don't forget to subscribe to the page if you just got here. Yeah, Captain Jack just stepping in it again, you know. I know some of y'all may have gotten here late. He did the same thing he did again on IG Live. I don't know why he keep doing it. I'm like, he keeps repeating himself. It's like all he wants to do all he wants to do is to keep boasting and bragging and patting himself on the back. You know, nobody, and that's the thing. Nobody ever said, let's cancel all the smoke. Who said that? Nobody said, let's cancel all the smoke. I don't see, I don't think Kwame ever said it. I know he said the breakfast club. 
But I don't remember him saying all the smoke. But Cam Jack, if you keep telling the people what they can't do, they'll show you what they can do. Don't ever start doing that and play that game. Talking about they can't stop anything and they can't do that. And you make it sound like the people are insignificant. When the people is what employ you. It's the people that pay you. It's the people, the reason that these sponsors are there, because they think the people want to see you. So you need to have a little bit more respect for, wait for it, the people. So realize what it does for you, bro. It does nothing. It just makes you, it makes people understand that you're living in misery. Don't be that person that's behind the side, bro. Follow people that you're a fan of. Because the, the hate and the comments don't work. Y'all hated on my page all week. And what happened the next week? I got nominated for podcast, of, the best podcast in the country. Y'all playing y'all self, bro. Y'all playing y'all self. Y'all don't even know the, y'all don't even know all the other stuff, the phone calls I've been getting. My first movie this year. So what I'm trying to tell y'all is when you be positive and you spread vibes, good things gonna start happening to you. But when you be negative, you're gonna stay in that spot with the negative people who who's sitting at home doing nothing, ranting. We not doing that. We not doing that, right? We winning in real time. In real time, I'm not, I don't hate on nobody. I show love to everybody and I'm winning in real time. Check the stats. This is not lies. This is not no opinion. We winning in real life. While y'all breathing, I'm winning. While y'all hating, I'm winning. So if, if you want to be on the winning side, if you want to be on the winning side, then spread vibes. Spread good vibes. Yes. Hey, hating is a, mis hating is a miserable, miserable place to be in. And y'all can say what y'all want, but y'all opinions are not strong enough to change anything that's going on. And I can't but think that y'all that y'all think y'all a thousand opinions is gonna do something to Showtime. Are you kidding me? Listen, man, I love all y'all, but it don't work here. It never worked on real ones. I'm really from the mud. I'm really from the dirt. Ain't no mystery in my history. You can Google me, and I'm glad I've grown. But my growth ain't for you. These, these checks I'm getting to, they ain't for you. You're not winning for a reason. Because you sit at home and hit that on people all day. Don't be that person, bro. Don't be that person. That's, that's a miserable life to live. You're really dying inside. And, and half of y'all are fake pages. Yeah, I heard it. Would you tell me in the car? You tell me, all right, you Muslim? Be proud to be Muslim. Proud of that. Every stick, proud of your deed. Proud of your deed, man. That's what I'm trying to say. Oh, man, try. And check this out. Don't don't be that person that has a fake page and go on everybody else's page and make comments from a fake page because they don't love themselves. Love yourself. Put your face on that page. Don't don't love yourself. I mean, you put my face on it. You, you be you. Don't hide, if, if, you know, don't, be, don't hide from your comments. Stand behind your comments like we do. That's not real. But at the same time, a fake page only says two things. You don't, you don't, love, you don't love who you are. You can't look yourself in the mirror. And it's, it's no need for me to kick you because you can't, you feel like that. I'm going to pray for you. I'm going to ask Allah to give you the strength to love yourself. I'm going to ask Allah to give you the strength to stop worrying about what other people are saying and try to benefit your life. Because one thing about it, Kwame Brown, Kwame Brown rich, he good. Steven Jackson, super rich, he good. Y'all comment on both our pages. Think about that. Y'all comment on, on Kwame Payne's, Kwame rich. Y'all comment on my page, I'm rich. But can't say the same about everybody that's with the fake pages. So look, bro, worry about what you control. Don't worry about Kwame, don't worry about me because y'all not stopping nothing neither one of us got going on. All right, let that man, I, I'm not telling my ox and my fans from the ghetto to go on his page and say all this. I'm not doing that because we don't move like that. We don't move like that. We're in a different space, right? So just, I'm just trying to help y'all out, man, so y'all so days can be better because y'all stressing and struggling for nothing. It ain't got to be like that, bro. It ain't got to be like that. 
Y'all call it what y'all want. The mystery, there ain't no mystery in my history. I've been through real street stuff and I ain't going back. And anybody really from the bottom that made it out ain't trying to go back. So y'all can have that. And one thing I won't do is play myself off the streets for a whole bunch of people that I don't know, that I never see, and that ain't that ain't support me in no type of way. Alright? So I'm trying to help y'all, man. I'm trying to help y'all. I'm praying for y'all. Y'all need the love. Y'all need to hit the love y'all self first. And you wonder why you're in the position you're in because you stand behind. You go on people's pay. Quickest way to stay unsuccessful. That's the quickest way to not have God's favor. Right? Man, I can't believe y'all thought y'all was going to stop something. Y'all wrong for that, man. I can't believe y'all even thought that. More awards coming. More money coming. More sponsors coming. They call them by the day. Thank y'all. Thank y'all so much. Because, hey, hey, saw they number season. Y'all didn't know that? Salt ain't number season. But look, I'd rather them talk about it some type of way than not talk about it at all. You did. Is everybody out there? Much love to y'all. Organics, man. What's up, boy? I love y'all.